Hello, everyone. My name is Kathy Gibson. And Hello. my name is Dr. Mitchell Gibson. Of course, you know both of us as Master and Asari. Master and Asari. How are you? We miss you guys. We definitely miss you guys. We haven't seen them since last October. It's been October. And it's, it's been too long. And that's just been some of them. Yeah, it's been too long. Yeah. We were supposed to have an event earlier in the year. We couldn't have one in December. We didn't have one in January, February, or March. And now we can't have one in April. So we decided we would say, hi. hi. How are you? <laughs> <laughs> Another purpose of this video is to talk to you about the current situation that we're in with COVID-19. We have heard from many of you about your concerns about what's going on with the virus. Uh, what should you do? Should you follow protocol? Many of you are at home. You have been uh, commanded by the states to stay home. And that means that you have your children at home. They're not in school. So a lot of parents aren't used to being in the house all day, 24-7, uh, at least for the next month or so, uh, with children in the house. So I'm just going to ask for your patience. They are children. They don't want to be there either, but uh, they're in the house. So we're going to have to figure out how we're going to get along together in the house. The government has asked that we all probably just go outside for essentials. Uh, that means food, water. Uh, pharmacy, anything that you need for basic needs, but try to keep your social distancing, uh, try to stay at home as much as possible, and only go outside if you have to. Some of you are going to find your first gray hairs because you're not used to having kids at home. <laughs> <laughs> You'll live. There's worse things you could find. There's always uh, fear, high levels of anxiety when there's uncertain things, things of the unknown. Things we cannot see but are affecting us in any way. We, we want to know what's going on. When will things get back to normal? And we don't know when that is. And it's because of that uncertainty that people are very anxious about what to do. Are they going to have a job when this is all over? Are they going to be able to pay their bills? Are they able to feed their children and their family? These are great concerns. But... We've been hard at work trying to figure out ways to empower you so that you don't feel so helpless at home. And we did that with uh, Master Gibson coming up with the Spell of Raw that we gave for free on our website, tyro.com, T-Y-B-R-O.com. Look up the Spell of Raw. We also added into that practice asking for everyone to do 21 miracle prayers every day to help fight this darkness that is found itself onto our plane. In fact, it's worldwide, uh, but it's darkness, and darkness can be combated with light. This is the first time we've used the spell of Ra publicly, and a lot of people are having good results. Some people are scared. They say that um, when they listen to it, they feel a force that they don't understand. It is a force that has been used in the past to change things in the world, and the world got warmer. And what we want is for the warmth and the coolness to go into a much higher pattern of oscillation so that warm air helps kill the virus. When temperature gets above 80, 85, the virus tends to die. And that is what we want. We want to keep, keep an eye on most of the world, especially the highly populated areas. Um, what we see is that the highly populated areas, the temperature has gone up worldwide, which is exactly what we want. We just created a new sigil ward that you can get custom. You can put your name, your birth date, and address on it, and you can get it immediately or within a couple, couple of days at most. If you get it on Friday, you probably won't get it till Monday. So we want you to be a little bit more patient with that. If you order it during the week, you can get it much more quickly. It will help protect you from the entities that are causing some of these problems that we have. And we are being attacked by entities. Uh, anytime the entire world shuts down, sports, politics, bars, movies, restaurants, schools, all of those things shut down at the same time. That is true darkness. We also notice that several people, especially people that have been writing me, want to have hard copies of the, the war. They want to have a metal version they can hang in their homes. And so we decided to release three sizes of that. Um, and Michael's going to put out an email about that shortly. We're going to re release a 10 by 10, 
a 20 by, uh, actually a 5 by 5, a 10 by 10, and a 20 by 20 size so that you can put them up in your homes and we'll give you more information about those. But it's not going to be customized, but it'll be bigger and it'll be extremely strong because it's actual metal that you can use to put in your home, office, business, wherever you want to put it. Because there are sorcerers in the lower worlds that are attacking us. These are not demons. These are not entities or elementals or supernatural beings. These are human sorcerers that have banded together and chosen to attack their own race. Mm. As a result, things are changing in the world. Things are happening in the world that we can defend ourselves from. Politics is not helping. The governments are not doing nearly enough. What we have to do is to figure out ways to help ourselves. The spell of Ra, the radiators, the hard radiator. Use your spells. You have healing spells. You have magical spells. You have defense against the dark, defense against the dark arts. We have spent years preparing you for these moments. We weren't just sounding an unnecessary alarm. This is one of the things we were preparing you for, to be ready for. Now, with the tools that you have, let us use them. Also remember, children are in the house. So be patient. And also, mommy, mama, mommy, <laughs> mama, mommy. Feel empowered because you mama. are not powerless. And you have to have more faith than fear because there are higher powers that are here in place to fight this darkness. And it just takes you to give your two cents, put in your 10 minutes worth of the raw spell, put in your 21 miracle prayers a day. Look out for the elderly who may be shut in and, and can't get to get certain supplies or food or water. Look in on those people, the people or your neighbors, your family, your friends. Look in on them. Make sure that they're taken care of as well. Remember, we're in this together. And it's going to take all of us to change the vibration of this planet because right now uh, the darkness is winning because they've shut down everything. And we're in new territory. I think it was way back when, when there was the dark plague that had everybody just where it wiped out half of humanity. We don't have to suffer from that. We can do things. So don't feel powerless. Be empowered. Show God and the gods and your ancestors that you're not going to sit and just take it. Do the right things. Wash your hands often. Make sure that you're not putting yourself in harm's way. If you do those things and you do your practices and use your tools, then we can get through this together. So we, from us, we have been prepared. We have tools. We are ready. We just have to remember we have to use them. And we have to not give in to fear, as Osario said. We are a team, and we are going to rise above this. The president has already said he wants to come out of this sooner rather than later. China's already begun to open back up. Several governors across the country are saying we don't need to keep quarantine as long as we thought we did. That's positive. That's good news. Let's hold on to that. Let's build on that. And let's rise above this darkness. Thank you for watching us. Bye. Bye. We miss you guys.